Hey everybody, welcome to part 26 of our Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Interactive Theater Mode playthrough. Uh, last time we were in Wonderland and we had to deal with the uh, Psycho Queen of Hearts Sham of a Trial. Um, so now we're headed back to Daybreak Town and I did make a mistake at the end of the last video. This is going to be a short trip through Daybreak Town followed by a short stint back in Agrabah. Uh, it's, we're, we're coming up on like a, another few uh, short videos, but then we'll be going to a brand new world for this game. And that one should be a um, another uh, lengthy episode with lots of quests in the same world. So that being said, let's go ahead and start this trip back to Daybreak Town with quest 401, the Clock Tower part one so we're going back to the clock tower and we are looking for an aeroplane master ava you're really not yourself today i guess even four towers have their off days hey maybe talking about the book will cheer you up not a chance. Aha. Uh -huh. You were trying to pull a fast one on me, weren't you? No, no, I was joking. If you say so. But, I really do think it would be great if all the unions could work together and be friends. You know, I made a friend from another union today. They don't talk much, but I think they're just shy. We're meeting again tomorrow. That sounds fun. You better go home and get some sleep then. Okay, well, it was nice talking to you. I don't know what's got you down. But please cheer up. Thank you. If worst comes to worst, I want to leave the future to kids who see the world like you do. Let the wind carry you far, far away. my dandelions. Sorry. I'm sorry, I really am. There was something important I had to take care of. I hope you can forgive me. Are you still up for our adventure? It's up ahead. Are you with me? Ah, you're not ready yet. I had a feeling that might be the case. I'll be waiting, player. Have another dream? It was about your friend, wasn't it? You want to go search for him in the tower? No way! Only the four towers are allowed there. Besides, now's not a good time. I can't go into detail, but the foretellers... Well, lately, they've been disagreeing on a few things. 
Let's just say you should steer clear of that tower for the time being. Go and see what's happening at the tower. Alright, so that scene between Ephemer and Master Ava was not a dream. That scene was exactly the same one from back cover. Just to show, just to kind of line up where we are in this uh, Union Cross story right now. Quest 402, the Clock Tower Part 2, we are skipping. Quest 403, the Clock Tower Part 3, we are skipping. Quest 404, Investigating Ephemer, Part 1. We are looking for a bag of coins. I don't think this is a good idea. Are you even listening? No. Wait! Where are you going? Find other Keyblade wielders and ask them about Ephemer. Quest 405, Investigating Ephemer Part 2, we are skipping. Quest 406, Investigating Ephemer Part 3, we are skipping. Quest 407, Investigating Ephemer Part 4, we are skipping. Quest 408, Investigating Ephemer Part 5, we are looking for a Red Rose. I heard something interesting. It seems one of the Masters is recruiting Keyblade wielders with potential. I believe it's Master Ava, the one in the Fox Mask. These days, I see her around the plaza all the time. Quest 409, Investigating Ephemer Part 6, we are skipping. Investigating Ephemer Part 7, uh, Quest 410, we are skipping. And the last quest on our short visit back to Daybreak Town is Quest number 411, Investigating Ephemer Part 8, and we are chasing down a Dark Ball again.
Ephemer? The kid with the silver hair, right? I saw him talking to Master Ava the other day. I have a friend who knows the Master pretty well. Unfortunately, he's off completing a task in Agrabah. I don't know when he'll be back. Why don't you go and find him yourself? Alright, head to Agrabah to learn more about Master Ava. Alright, so... That's going to be the end of this video. Uh, you know what? No, it's not. Since there is only one storyline quest in Agrabah, before we come back to Daybreak Town, we're just going to... Uh, I'm going to make a rare exception and break my uh, separate videos by worlds rule for a minute here. So, we go to Agrabah, and quest 412, Answers in Agrabah, part 1, we're going to skip. Quest uh, 413, Answers in Agrabah, part 2, we're going to skip. Quest number 414, Answers in Agrabah, part 3, we're going to skip. Quest 415, Answers in Agrabah, Part 4, we're going to skip. Quest 416, Answers in Agrabah, Part 5, we're going to skip. Uh, quest 417, Answers in Agrabah, Part 6, we're going to skip. 418, Answers in Agrabah, Part 7, we're going to skip. Uh, 419, Answers in Agrabah, Part 8, we're going to skip. And then the only storyline quest in this uh, little quick trip back to Agrabah. Quest number 420. Answers in Agrabah part 9 and we are looking for a fat bandit. We're just going to consider this quick side trip to Agrabah part of this visit in Daybreak Town. So I, I can't justify doing another separate video just for one quest. Even though it's going to drive my OCD insane. All right, let's go find areas. What brings you out here? Huh? You were looking for me. So you want to know about Master Ava? I can't tell you much, except that I see her around the tower a lot. I don't know how to get inside, but there has to be a way, right? Yeah, 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 there has to be. Return to Daybreak Town and search around the tower for clues. All right, so we go back to Daybreak Town to Quest 421, back to the Tower Part 1, which we are going to skip. Quest 422, back to the Tower Part 2, we are going to skip. Quest number 423, back to the Tower Part 3, we are going to skip. Quest 424, back to the Tower Part 4, we are going to skip. And our last quest on this one, well, look at that. Quest number 425, our, our last stop in Daybreak Town for now. The Four Tellers Might, and our target is Master Ava herself. So this should be an interesting one. Master Ava? Your player. Why are you here? Ephemer. Yes, I know him, but you still haven't answered my question. You came to find me because of some rumor? You had a dream? I see. Ephemer said he was waiting for you here in your dream. 
but this place is restricted. So you thought that he may have gotten caught up in the problems that we foretellers have been having lately. And because someone saw us talking the other day, you thought that maybe I had something to do with it? You're honest. I like you. You're not too far off base, but I can't tell you much else right now. Master Ava! Show me what you can do. Alright, we are about to go toe to toe with one of the foretellers. I mean, it's not going to be much of a challenge because she's level 120, we're like 308. That, uh, that was a boss quest, incidentally. Not bad. I see a lot of potential in you. But I also see sadness in your heart. Hanging on to it will eventually lead to darkness. You need to somehow let it go. With this little one helping you, you'll be fine. Now, go home. And I'm sorry, but this area is strictly off limits, alright? Sure, be back tomorrow. So it's you. You are the friend he told me about. Sorry, player. Who is it? You? was one doozy of a day. Bet you didn't think you'd end up having to fight a foreteller. I'm sorry. But it wasn't fun for me either, you know. Master Ava, what are you doing here? Please, call me Ava. Did you show him the dream of Ephemer? No, that wasn't me. Then perhaps it was Ephemer himself. Huh? How is that possible? Ephemer's getting very close to the truth. He's fallen into an unchanged state and now finds himself in a different realm. From that realm, I believe he tried reaching out to him. If they connected, even in a dream, that means he's getting closer to that realm too. Whether he continues down that path is up to his own heart. Chirithi, you have to protect Player from the nightmares, so the wind can carry him far away from here. Okay, so once again things are getting interesting. 
Ephemer is apparently in a different realm and calling out to us through our dreams. We just went toe to toe with a foreteller. Um, so that's going to be it for this one. And when we come back, we will be making our first trip to the Beast's Castle world. Well, our first trip to Beast's Castle in this game. Obviously, we took quite a we took a couple trips there way back in uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. But um, yeah, anyway, that's going to be it for this one. And when we come back, uh, as far as Union Cross is concerned, we have a new world to explore. And I think we'll be there for we'll be there for a little bit. There's 50 quests once we get there, but of course not all of them have cutscenes attached, so we'll be skipping a few. But you know, it should be a should be a lengthy first visit to that world. And uh, yeah, as always, thank you all for watching. Hope you everyone's enjoying the journey so far, and I will see you all for the next part.